The AE4 is out and replaced by the new AE5. The new AE5 is larger than before. The body is 2.6 inches longer, 0.5 inch wider, and 0.6 inch taller. The wheelbase is stretched by 3.1 inches, primarily to enhance interior space. Rear seat space is excellent, and the cargo capacity of the exclusively hatched lineup is a big 26 cubic feet. US-bound AE5 will offer a choice of two engines. The AE5 gets a 268 horsepower to 0 0.0 liter turbocharged for with Auto's first use of a variable turbine turbocharger. Moving up to the S5, brings a twin turbocharged 3.0 liter V6 with 362 horsepower. Both engines get dual clutch automatics and a hybrid system that consists of a 24 horsepower electric motor with 170 pound feet of torque connected to the transmission output shaft. From the driver's seat, the interior is dominated by a massive curved glass panel on the dashboard that Audi calls the digital stage. The panel houses two large screens and curves to give a cockpit-like feel. Directly in front of the driver is an 11.9-inch gauge and information cluster. The center touch screen housed in the curved panel is even larger at 14.5 inches and contains vehicle settings, climate controls, the audio system, and navigation. Expect the AE5's base price to rise over that of the Sportback, especially as the base engine is now as powerful as the outgoing AE5's upgraded tune. That model started just under $50,000, so we expect the new AE5 will start in that ballpark. Sport or S5 variants should begin around $59,000. We anticipate that the new Audi AE5 lineup will arrive mid-2025.